I'll be showing you the Winnebago 37F Adventurer. And this RV is equipped with a lot of <laughs> slide outs, the three of them. And I'll show you the exterior and then shortly the interior. It's a clean RV. It's only got 5,200 miles on it to gas. And the unique thing, there's a door on the driver's side, which is rare for an RV. And this, from tip to tip, will be 39 feet, two inches. The interior kitchen is well thought out with the cockpit accompanied with a leather captain's chair and a navigation chair as well as leather. And what I like about it is there's not a dinette booth, so you're not forced to or be dictated to where you're going to eat your food. You have the option of sliding the table back and moving the chairs. And as we enter the stateroom, that's a king size bed, actually, and it and it retracts. It's very similar to in a comfort bed or um, something you would find at a high end retail. TV in the bedroom, cabinetry, lots of storage, and we make our way back to the cockpit. I like this refrigerator because it actually is covered with furniture, so it doesn't look like a typical fridge. That's the half bath with storage and a fan. I like the wood accents. I like the darker wood, personally. This microwave has never been used before. That's the, the trim. I like the attention to detail that Winnebago puts forth in the salon area in the kitchen as well. Counter space looks pretty good. The backsplash is kind of cool. Quality. I would like eventually a wrap around, like an L couch would be nice. I'm just being nitpicky. Plenty of room in here. And it's got all the bells and whistles, satellite, navigation. Super excited to get this thing on the road. They've got speakers in the ceiling as well. A surround sound system with subwoofer and the adjacent speakers behind. You can see up there in a the cabinet, there we go. And I like the, the door, kind of in the mid-cabin area. And again, kind of looking at the layout from different angles. Of course, there's your makeup mirror. Thanks so much.